the new Senate health care bill, in order to pass it with just 51 votes, Senate Republicans have to move by the end of next week. Because after that, Lots basically, we'll call it a Graham pass Cassidy. or their authority Lots to pass the bill with just 51 yeah. votes will expire. Uh, and you know in the Senate, everything needs 60 votes to advance. Uh, so this is kind of like the last the ditch, the last shot effort to we pass a Republican that bill failed. that would repeal and replace much of me. former President Obama's Affordable Care Act. If the bill does pass, it's, it's a major restructuring of the health care system. And it, the bill will do two things. One is it'll take most of the money or part of the money that was allocated to former President Obama's coverage expansion and will put that into a big pot and send it out to the states and tell the states, okay, here's money. You set up health care for people who need it in your state howsoever you see fit. That's one thing. Then the other thing that people don't talk about as much is what it does to Medicaid. Now Medicaid is a federal state health insurance program for low income people, covers more than 70 million people, and in terms of the number of people covered, it is the largest government insurance program. And what the bill would do is, in the future, it would put a limit on federal spending for Medicaid. Well, Jimmy Kimmel, earlier in the year, talked about s surgery that his infant son had, life-saving surgery, and he made a heartfelt statement about how all American families should have access to this level of care. Then later on, Senator Cassidy called that the Jimmy Kimmel test. And Senator says his bill passes the test. Jimmy Kimmel says it doesn't. And the, 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 the issue is pre-existing conditions. The bill does say that insurers cannot turn people away because of a pre-existing condition, but it opens the door to changes at the state level that would allow insurers to charge higher premiums.